Betty Boop's little pal is really sweet and kind of emotional. I think this may be the first time I've become really emotional at a Betty Boop cartoon. This was released in 1934. It is, of course, a Fleischer Studios cartoon. It's directed by Dave Fleischer and Myron Waldman. And Mae Questel voices Betty Boop and also Pudgy. And I think this is actually the first Pudgy cartoon. And certainly it's the first time I'm meeting Pudgy. Pudgy is Betty Boop's little pal. Her little dog, he is this adorable, squishy little puppy dog. And the name Pudgy is just perfect, absolutely perfect. And she's having a picnic with Pudgy and everything is going really well. And she sings this gorgeous song about her little pal. And then Pudgy makes a mess, ruins the picnic, and she's annoyed. And then something happens to Pudgy. And I I won't say what, I won't spoil it, but it is heartbreaking. If you like animals... And if you don't like sad animal films, it's a little bit tough. I'm not saying it's impossible to watch if you cry at animal films, but for a a 1930s cartoon with Betty Boop, I wasn't expecting to get that choked up. And it's really sweet and really effective and beautifully animated. We have some other dogs in this, not just Pudgy. And I love how they all have different designs, different breeds. It's really great to look at. The music with this is great. The backdrops are gorgeous. The park scene where they're having the picnic is particularly beautiful. And the close-ups of Betty Boop and Pudgy are gorgeous as well. Really thoroughly enjoyed this. Part of me wants to say it's one of my favourite Betty Boop cartoons because I thought it was pretty flawless. But at the same time, I don't like sad animal films or sad animal cartoons. I should point out, it's not technically sad as such, but there are certainly strong emotional aspects to it. But... I wouldn't, I don't think, I probably would watch it again, actually. I'm trying to work out if I would watch it again because I don't like getting emotional at films. I watch them to escape negative emotions and sorrow and heartache. But no, I would. I think I probably would. It's not that bad. But at the same time, I don't know if I can therefore call it my favourite because I couldn't watch it again and again. But nevertheless... I really thoroughly enjoyed it as an introduction to Pudgy, whether it is definitely the first Pudgy cartoon or if it's just my introduction to the character. I love him and I cannot wait to see what else little Pudgy has in store. I don't know how frequently Pudgy appears, but I'm really looking forward to finding out. And for now, I really enjoyed Betty Boop's Little Pal and obviously it's one that I'm very happy to recommend.